。What's up, b l a d r i n 
and you've got this thing. Skyhammer doesn't work so well in his powered up combiner mode. Sad to say. His torso ends up looking a bit smaller than it would in robot mode because of the way the wings fold up. And with the way his legs collapse, his hips are angled to sort of prohibit any meaningful movement. But he throws out some armpit lasers, so everything's fine. Really, you're only going to put this guy in this mode to admire his perfect period headgear. These old timey, what hell, wind commander goggles. When I first transformed this guy, I swear I laughed for a solid two minutes at these goggles. They're so perfectly silly. It's beautiful. And with airlift, you can make it even more ridiculous. Flip up this central nipple and bung airlift on in his armour mode. Well, it, he's giving him a hug. That's it. That's what it is. Bromance. Of course, he can litter his form with more minicons, and of course, I'm going to bust out the emergency team again to show you. Boom. If there's one flaw with this figure, though, it's the fact he doesn't really hold together very well. Especially in combined mode, the wings do like to droop with the weight of the arms, and his chest is pretty much always untabbing itself. And that's a downside, but there's so many upsides to this figure, I don't see how it really makes any difference. So all round, Skyhammer is one suitably stormy son of a bitch. He's an example of the excellence Power Core Combiner's left behind in its death throes. He's fathoms beyond the likes of Huffer and the Wave Oneers. There's just so much more going on with this figure. Or should that be? Figures. A solid, good quality toy, brimming with detail and personality. You can have your mech tech helicopters, minicon A10s and ultra pretenders. This is who I think could be worthy to possess the name Skyhammer. And it was all yellow.